What's up guys? It's your girl Chelsea here with another Timu review. Um, my last video did so well on YouTube that I decided to do another product review. Um, I gained a few referrals off of that video, so I decided, hey, why not? Uh, let's take, you know, what you made from those referrals, the credits, um, and let's get some more stuff and get it in here because, you know, just because... The first haul was good things. Doesn't mean the second haul will be. Um, but I have 15 items. I'm not going to be able to show all 15. A couple of them were a gift. I've already given uh, those to who they were going to. Um, and she actually loved them. But um, I will have at the end of the video uh, showing what the item was. Of course, how much it was on the site, um, what what it looked like when it came. Um, and I will tell you up front, she loves them both. So, um, And then there's two other, I, I think one or two other items that are actually in use. Um, I had to go ahead and use them. So, uh, but uh, as well, you know, just like with those products at the end, I will have short clips of what they looked like when they came and all of that. Um, of course, if you like this style of content, please leave a like. Um, please share the video. Um, if you would, if you have like any video suggestions, please leave it down in the comments. If there are any product reviews you would like for me to do um, on any of these items, leave it down in the comments. I'm happy to do that just to show you that these items actually do work. Um, some of them I have already used and I can actually show you that they work now. Um, this video is not going to be nearly as long as the other one. I'm not going to fly through it. I will be detailed, but it was about 45 minutes long and I just think a lot of our attention spans just can't be held that long, especially if the person isn't as enter entertaining as others. I mean, I can be entertaining, but, you know, I'm just more here to show you that this website is most definitely legit. Um, <clears throat> if you would, um, if you enjoy the video um, or my content, please subscribe. I would appreciate that. Um, it just helps push the video into the algorithm. And um, I don't know, I just, uh, I, I really enjoyed the last haul that I got. And so I figured why not take the proceeds from that haul uh, that I made um, and let's get some more stuff and review it and look at it uh, because just because the first haul was good doesn't mean the second haul will be um, and I'm sorry if I repeat myself I try not to do that but it's just something I do okay so, let's get to it so what I'm gonna do I'll just pull the stuff out like I did the last time I'm gonna show it to you give you my opinion on how I feel about it um, I'll give you the price that it was at the time that I bought it because the prices do change. Um, there will be a link in the description if you follow it. It is my referral code to Timu. If you are a new Timu user and you use my link, you will get a discount on every order from here on out. But those, do, this, those discounts do change every month. They're not always the same, so I can't tell you what that discount will be, but you do get a discount. <laughs> Um, and then I do always like to disclose that I do make a small commission off of it. Other than that, I think that takes care of all of the housekeeping. Um, of course, oh, uh, also, I am testing out a camera right now. Uh, usually, I use my iPhone and a lapel mic. If you all think the volume is too low or that you don't like the image whatever please critique it in the comments and I mean that wholeheartedly because if I need to go back to using the iPhone I'm more than happy to I'm just I'm doing a little bit of trial and error right now as far as recording and editing goes so now here we go uh, first item we're gonna start with um, which I was so very excited about um, because that as I've mentioned before, I am a huge couponer, uh, crafter, budgeter. Like, if I can get something on a good budget, I, I'm just stoked. 
if I can get a good deal on something. You will find me at DG Dollar General on Saturdays, 5 off 25 sale, um, CVS and Walgreens, you know, using the extra bucks or, you know, Walgreens cash or whatever it's called. Um, I love just, I just love things like that, fetch rewards. Um, and if you haven't heard of any of those things or don't know what those are, ask below. I'm happy to make a video about it. Um, so, any questions, just comment below. I'll be sure to either answer you in the comment section or I'll make a video. So, but here we go. Let's go on and, and get into this because that's why y'all are here. Um, first thing um, is the... 10-piece uh, microfiber um, washcloths, kitchen towels, whatever you want to refer to them as. And this is how they come. The reason that I got these um, is because I am tired of buying the Swiffer dry refills. And when you have dogs or cats or pets that have fur... Um, of course, you know they like to shed. Microfiber seems to be the best thing to pick that up. And um, instead of me having to vacuum every single day, um, these will work perfect because they will actually fit the Swiffer. Um, I mean, it'll be off by a little bit, but not much. But, um, oh. They are about the size I expected them to be, just like last time. Everything's about what I expected it to be. Very soft. You can tell that it's microfiber. It's purple on one side, gray on the other. These can be used, I mean, it, you can use it as a washcloth, uh, to wash your face with. Uh, like I said, I'm going to use them uh, for cleaning the floors. Um, I mean, I might use them like as a dish rag or something like that, but... Something else you all learned about me in the last video is I'm funny about textures, so you won't, I won't personally use this as a washcloth because of the texture. I I'm not big on microfiber and using it as a washcloth, um, but I will use it, use it on like dishes or the floors, um, never windows when uh, they streak windows really bad microfiber is not very good for windows um washing the car whatever um so i'm actually really happy about these again it is a 10 pack um and they were two dollars and 59 cents for 10 of those now the swiffer dry cloths are around well i know the bigger box is 12 dollars at dollar general um, the smaller box, I think it has maybe 10 in it. It's still five or six dollars. So these are reusable. After I use them, I can just toss them in the washer, throw them in the dryer, and I don't have to worry about buying refills over and over and over again. Uh, I just feel like that's a waste of money, especially in the times we're in right now. So, okay, on to the next. Now, this is a product that I have actually already used. Um, and again, like last time, there will be a screen grab right here next to me. Um, it'll show you what it looks like on Timu. Um, you're going to see what it looks like in person. And then also the price will be on there as well. But I will go ahead and tell you now what the price of it is. But I have already tested this out. Make sure that it works. Um, it was something I desperately needed because for some reason my laptop mounts. The one on the laptop itself is going out. Um, so I needed a wireless mouse and I am notorious for losing the USB receivers on these. So I try not to spend too much money on them because I'll eventually lose the receiver and I'll eventually have to buy another one. But I love this mouse. My son did too, um, actually. So it takes two AAA batteries. I will tell you that straight up. You'll have to have the batteries for it. Um, and then it does have the USB receiver. Look how thin this thing is, y'all. Now, I know they're coming out with ergonomic mount mice and all this. And that is something I would love to invest in in the future. You know, because I'm getting older and arthritis and all that. But for now, I love this mouse. It is lightweight. Um, I mean, the clicks are there, but they're not too loud. The scroll works great. It has the uh, CPI where you can... Um, 
do the distance of the wireless transmission between the USB receiver and then the mouse itself. So like if you have to be further away from your laptop while you're using it, I don't know why you would be, but if you are, it has that so that you can stretch out that transmission. Great buy. Um, it was only $2.98 <clears throat> before this one. I think the cheapest mouse I ever found was five bucks at Walmart and that was for a wired mini mouse. So, um, I thought this was a wonderful, wonderful buy. And just to show you, I mean, I can't show you that it works. I don't have my computer uh, hooked up, but um, I will show you that just when you turn it on, the, the laser pops on and it's not going to do anything because course it's not laying down but when it does lay down it works so um or when you hook it to the computer that laser does stay on until it's laid down um but great buy i thought that was awesome and it looks exactly like it did it, I, it was exactly what i expected it to be so and that's what i like i like getting things that i am expecting i don't like being surprised with a shirt that is too small or uh, something that looks like the color blue and it shows up brown and or you know whatever um this go around i kind of focused more on beauty products too um i'm not huge on makeup of course i am wearing, wearing makeup right now and that's just because i like to try to look professional and not homeless um but I got these eyebrow stencils. I'm horrible with my eyebrows. I cannot pluck my own eyebrows. Um, most of the time, well, when I can afford it, or when I could afford it, I would have them threaded. Um, now I just touch them up as I can, the best I can. But when I seen these, I was so excited. Um, this is a, a pack, six-piece eyebrow stencil pack. Um... And it is different types of stencils. So you've got classic, straight, S-shaped, curved, upward, nobility. Um, and I mean, just by the feel of them through the package. I mean, they're flexible. Uh, they're reusable. Um, so for people like who would really want to, you know, make their eyebrows stand out. For me personally, I'll be just kind of sticking with the classic or the... You know, maybe the S-shaped or something. I don't go all crazy with my makeup. So, um, I just thought that was really neat. Um, paid seven for those. Um, so, and again, I'm happy to show these in action. Um, I will say that uh, on the back, it does, like, give you different ways of doing it. Um, it says they, uh, great for makeup. Um, for doing like your own eyebrow styles um, it's made with ABS plastic it's clear reusable um, but what it does basically it's a stencil and you just place it over your eyebrow and you trace around and then color it in which I know a lot of people can do that with free hand and my hats off to you for being able to do that okay next item which kind of falls in with that one um, is <clears throat> this is another makeup stencil um, except there are 32 pairs in here and these are eyeliner and eyeshadow stencils so basically there's four models for eyeshadow how you want your eyeshadow to be um, and then there's six models for eyeliner. So for all you ladies or gentlemen, I don't care. It's none of my business at all. Um, if you want the cat eyeliner, it had like, and that's something I've never been able to accomplish. I've never been able to achieve. I may do a video just seeing if I can do it with these stencils. Um, but they have um, the cat eye the cat eyeliner stencil um and what i like about these is they stick to your eye so you know you can stick it and then do whatever you're gonna do and then take it off um 
So there's four pairs of each for the eyeshadows. There's a uh, six pair of the cat eyeliner, two pair of the sexy, two of the extravagant thin fishtail, and double line um, for a total of thirty two stencils and these were a dollar thirty four. Um, again, I'm super excited about these because I am not a makeup guru whatsoever. Um, and I would love to be able to do some nice makeup, um, and make it look pretty and, um, have a little help because some people just aren't that artistic and that I'm one of those people. So, um, but this, I think, oh, I think I already said it was $1.34. Um, and it, again, looks just like it did on the website. And it was exactly what I was expecting. Alrighty, on to the next. Um, these, I am super excited about. I don't know why I get so excited about stuff like this, but I do. Um, hair tools. So, this is a, um, let's see, one, two, three, four, five six piece set um of hair tools uh, of course you have your your comb um this one i believe is to help you make a bun uh these are to help you like pull your hair um okay so <laughs> i'm gonna try to try to do this the right way so you would put like you would pull your hair back in a ponytail and put the loop through there and then bring that up and over down through the ponytail to make like a decorate it's it, it's kind of like a design in your hair um especially for people like me with long hair i'm always looking for new hair tools or clips or ponytails uh just new things to do with my hair because it is so long and i'm not cutting it um because i just I'm not a big not a big short hair fan if you got short hair I, I if you can rock it go for it i just can't so um i know this one helps with doing like a fishtail braid um and it does have uh some instructions on the back but just like with anything else if you can't figure it out just go to youtube you'll figure it out um <laughs> but if you want to see me do it um you know just to test the product out is it gonna snap on me i mean my hair is thick thick so um you know is it gonna snap the first time i use it it might well but we don't know until we tried huh so if y'all want to see me use those um just leave a comment below and, and i'm happy to do so but those were um 58 cents that's what i paid for those and again keep in mind these are prices i paid the day that i ordered this um they have lightning deals all the time they have uh percent off deals all the time prices change all the time so even though i might have paid 58 cents for these today you know that day they could be a dollar 58 today you never know i'm just telling you what i personally paid for it that day and then of course i didn't pay full price because of the credits and all that Alrighty, on to the next, which was one of my favorites. Um, I don't know why. I love these little lighters. Uh, look, I gave it right away, but um, they have these, re they're USB lighters. You charge them. Um, so instead of having to like add butane, well, I guess I could show you all the packaging first. So this is a USB flameless lighter i got the dragon one there were different colors and i chose the dragon so the package will come with your charger a little bitty charger there and it actually worked right out of the package so um I don't know I just think it's super cute and that's where you put your charger in at and then you open it up and it lights up blue and um, then to get the coil to come on um, you know if you're a cigarette smoker with like I am um, and you just touch that blue and it turns it on and turns it off I don't know why I'm I love these so much but I, I guess I, I 
like having them around the house in case of an emergency. I don't have a lighter or whatever the case may be. Um, but I just love having these around the house. So, um, and then when you shut it, it does turn it off so that you don't have to worry about running your battery down. Um, I had one, it was, but it was like, um, a, a, like, cir like a cylinder, um, almost shaped like a cigarette type one, and it was silver, and I had that thing for the longest time, and now I don't know where it is, but I loved that thing. I kept it in a certain spot, and it was always my emergency if I don't have a lighter, lighter. Plus, I just think, and this one, though, I'll probably actually carry with me because I think it's so neat looking. I just love the dragon on it. I don't know. I'm a weirdo. But that was uh, $1.98, which is less than most of your lighters you buy today. And you don't have to buy butane for it or anything. You just simply charge it up. All right. Okay, um, next we have, oh, oh, this right here. I was so excited to get this thing. This is an OBD scanner. So, y'all might not think this is cool, but I do. Because, um, now I can read the codes on my husband's vehicle, or my vehicle when I finally get one. Um, but... It is, um, so it's, looks like that, and then you plug it into where you would normally put an OBD scanner, which is usually up under the dash, under your steering wheel, uh, you put it in, and then you Bluetooth it to your phone, and then it sends all the information to your phone. So let's say your check engine light comes on and you don't want to go to one of the many auto stores, AutoZone, O'Reilly's, whatever, um, and you want to just scan it yourself, bam, there you go. And you just plug it in, and like I said, you Bluetooth it to your phone, and um, I have not personally used it yet. If you want me to do a product review just to show you how to use it and if it works, I'm happy to do so. Um, this is probably one of the ones that I was most excited to get again because I have been doing work on my husband's vehicle ever since my dad passed. I've had this earn, yearning to uh, learn uh, more mechanically um, inclined stuff, uh, learn how to work on the furnace or any kind of a appliance, the car, um, because I just, I want to save us as much money as possible. Times, like I said, times are just really hard right now. Um, so to have something like this, and you know, if I have a friend of mine who's got, you know, they're, they've got something showing up on their dash and they want to know what it is, bring it to me. Hey, I can run, you know, run a scan on it. Um, this was $3.98. I think that's pretty awesome for something like this um, where even if you go to Harbor Freight which is like the family dollar of like tool stores <laughs> hardware <laughs> whatever you want to call it <laughs> um, but even there you know you're, you're not gonna find one like this that cheap so um, I thought that was pretty awesome now uh, I hope it works. I think that it will. It had great reviews. Um, I think it had like four point something stars on Timu. Uh, people saying that it worked perfectly. So I'm super excited to use this. And again, if y'all want to see me do a product review of that particular item, just comment below. I'm happy to do so. Alrighty. We're getting down to the last couple items here, and then what we'll be doing is um, I will be editing in the other items um, and their prices. Um, this And this was out of the box, but I'm going to put it back in the box um, just so I can show you. So this is a, it's called Lazy Eyeshadow. This is color number three. 
and this is how it came and basically what it is is lazy eyeshadow so um it kind of looks almost like a lip gloss thing um but it's not it's a it's a like a liquid eyeshadow and then you just pull the cap off like that and then you can see it right there at the top it's a two-tone um there are several different colors this just happened to be the color i like the best um you pull down like that to bring it up um which i would not recommend doing that if you're actually applying it i would recommend keeping it kind of low so that you don't smack because that's liquid and it will break um and then you just you know apply it to your eyes um i have used it it does work very well i do like the color I feel like the color could be a little darker, but honestly, for a dollar fifty-two, um, it's not too bad. I don't know if y'all can see that or not, shimmering on my hand, but um, yeah. And then you can like blend it in, um, which is what usually what I do with my eyeshadows. I'll use two or three colors and then just blend them in. But I really like that too. That was cool. So it's something to keep like in your purse. Um, and then the last item that I'm going to show you is... Now, this is not Cricut brand again. This is not Cricut brand. It is a cutting mat, though, for the Cricut machine. It's a 24 by 12. So anybody who... Again, y'all know I'm a crafter. The only thing about this that I didn't like is the fact that when they sent it... Okay, this is a pack again. This is the packaging they sent it in. Everything came in that bag. Um, and they had this kind of folded up, right? So there's some bins in the back of it. I don't necessarily love that. But I can work with it because I can just lay it out, you know, lay something heavy on it to flatten it out. And it rolling through the Cricut machine a few times, it'll flatten it out too. Um, but it is the standard grip. It looks exactly, I mean, almost identical to the Cricut mat. It just doesn't have Cricut up here. Um, I don't know if you can use it in the silhouette, but I'm sure you can. Um, but what it basically is, it's, it is sticky. Um, so you take it out of this package and then there's a film over top of the mat itself that it is sticky so that you can place your vinyl there and it will hold the vinyl in place vinyl felt leather whatever you're cutting uh cardstock it'll hold it in place um, and cut your vinyl um but i needed a longer one so i can start doing longer projects right now i only have the 12 by 12s and the 12 by 12s can kind of limit you to how big your designs are four dollars and 98 cents now for that i haven't really watched a whole lot of other videos about timu um or other people reviewing it because i didn't want my opinion to be swayed now that i've done this is my second haul um i think i might go and watch and see what other people are saying and thinking i could just be I'm more of a beggars can be choosers type person, so I could just be like really just excited because I'm getting cool stuff for cheap. I don't know. Um, I know the stuff from my last haul I'm still using today, and I think I did that video about a month ago. So um, I still use the stuff. I use it every day. Um, so if if y'all haven't seen that video, you can go back and check it out. Don't. If you don't want to sit through the full 45 minutes, trust me, it won't hurt my feelings if you don't. Um, I get it. My attention span is not that great either. So, all in all, I think this was a great purchase as well. Please stay tuned so that you can see the other products that you didn't get to see in this video. Um, along with their prices. And again, uh, thanks so much for joining me. Um... Like, share, comment, subscribe, and uh, yeah, we will see you on the next one. Later. Okay, as promised, 
um, I wanted to show you all uh, the few items that I couldn't show you in the unboxing um, because they're already in use. The first item um, is the uh, 16 foot LED lights. Now this is not the kind um, they have different when you're looking at the Timu site there's many different kinds of these and um, some of them are Bluetooth compatible and some are not. This particular one is not. I, I actually thought that it was um, because they do not send a battery in the remote. I will note that. However, that battery um, <clears throat> can be purchased anywhere. I think it's a C uh, hmm. C025 or something along those lines. It's about the size of a quarter. Um, if you have a remote like that laying around your house, you probably already have one. I did, so we were actually able to go ahead and hook these up. It was for my son's room, which I'm actually getting ready to show you pictures of. But this is what you get in the package. Um, you get the cord uh, that hooks to the lights and then they're rolled up on that row um, and then you get the remote but it, it does need a battery if you don't get the smart kind and then if you get the smart kind of course you can always use bluetooth okay and then i also wanted to show uh what they look like um they do change colors they don't just stay blue that's just my son's favorite color he ended up using two um extension cords to be able to uh, run them along the top of his room. Um, a 16 foot uh, went halfway, so I'm gonna go ahead and get him another roll. Um, and of course I'll put, you know, the price and everything right here. Um, I, I think I only paid four or five dollars for it. Um, I think it was a great deal. The lights are beautiful, as you can see. Um, and they lined the top of his room great. I thought, I thought he did a great job. Um, so uh, we we're definitely going to be getting him another roll. And then you'll be seeing the other two products in the next clip. Okay, so um, as I was stating, um, there are a couple items that I actually got for others as gifts and I'm actually um, recording this before I record the actual reaction I want to go ahead and give them their gifts so um, these are I got two pair of these um, which I'll show you the other pair as well but um, this these are compression socks I got the large extra large may have been able to get away with uh, small um, medium but really, I think the large, extra large did the best. I wear a size uh, 9 shoe, if that helps y'all out at all. Um, they're super cute. Uh, so they go from their compression socks, um, and they help tremendously. I broke my leg, at, like I've said a million times, uh, over a little over a year ago, and have tried finding things that would help with swelling, and these, they really do the trick. Um... And I only pay, I believe, $1.89 for a pair. Um, so, that's them right there. Um, so, I just wanted to show those to you all, you know, while they were still in the package. And the next thing, um, again, this is a gift for somebody, but this I've only paid. Um, I'll have to look the price up again, but I, I want to say it was like a dollar eighty or two eighty nine or something but it's a net it's a really pretty necklace um and if I can get it to focus okay now I think I might have got the focus a little bit better but it says um so I'm not focusing very well anyway uh it says a piece of my heart has wings um, half angel wing, half heart. Um, there's the chain. Pretty long chain on the back. I'm sure it's kind of weak, I would say. Um, not 100% sure of that, but 
Um, I mean, for just a couple dollars, I think it's beautiful. I got it for a friend of mine who lost her, her daughter. Um, so, uh, but I thought it was really pretty. And I thought it came in in, in great condition. You know, that was the packaging um, that it came in. Mm -hmm.